Hello everyone, welcome back again with us in another episode of Military TV. Since the Second World War, the United States, Russia, and China, and a host of other nations have lost vessels and their crews to accidents. Operating submarines is a risky business under the best of circumstances, and will likely remain so. Even the highest technology nuclear submarines can end up on the ocean floor if the crew isn't careful or the technology fails. Here are some submarine accidents from 2000 to 2021. Let's check it out. At number one, we have Kursk K-141 from Russia. The worst submarine disaster that happened in 2000 was Russia's loss of K-141 Kursk, which was a Project 949A anti-class or Oscar II nuclear-powered guided missile submarine. The massive 16,000-ton submarine was destroyed in a massive explosion on August 12, 2000, which killed all 118 members of its crew. Kursk was an Oscar II-class cruise missile submarine commissioned into the Russian Navy in December 1994. In addition, Kursk was one of the 30 vessels that took part in the Summer X exercise. The submarine suffered an explosion while preparing to fire dummy torpedoes during the exercise. The leakage of high test peroxide from one of the Type 65 torpedoes was believed to have caused the explosion. The explosion completely destroyed the first three compartments. 23 of the 118 crew were left alive in the ninth compartment when the submarine hit the seafloor, but they died subsequently due to lack of oxygen. After the Kursk disaster, the Russian Navy removed hydrogen peroxide fuel torpedoes from service. Number 2. Chengqing 361 from China The submarine hull number 361, named the Great Wall, was one of the Ming-class diesel-electric submarines of the People's Liberation Army Navy. In April 2003, all 70 men aboard the sub perished by suffocation due to a lack of oxygen. It was one of China's worst peacetime military disasters. The PLA Navy's commander Xi Yunxing and political commissar Yang Huaqing were both dismissed as a result of the accident. The submarine was conducting exercises in the Yellow Sea between Korea and Shandong province at the time of the incident. Malfunction in the diesel engines which consumed the oxygen within the submarine caused the suffocation. The crippled submarine remained afloat for 10 days as it was on a no-contact mission. The half-submerged Ming-361 was finally identified by Chinese fishermen on April 25, 2003. The boat was towed from the accident location to its home port at Qingdao. Number 3. K-152 Nerpa from Russia The Russian K-152 Nerpa suffered an accident when it was conducting an underwater test run in the Pacific Ocean, causing the death of 20 of the 208 men aboard. The incident was the worst Russian submarine disaster since the sinking of the Kursk in 2000. Nerpa is an Akula-class nuclear-powered attack submarine. The accidental activation of the firefighting system released Freon gas into the air in the K-152 Nerpa. The members in the submarine suffered from suffocation and could not activate breathing kits. The rest of the crew were unaware of the situation until the warning siren sounded after large amounts of gas had been released into the submarine. Six crew and 14 civilian workers were killed and 21 people were injured. The casualties were transferred to a military hospital in Vladivostok. Then, the submarine was delivered to India in December 2011 on a 10-year lease and is currently operated under the name INS Chakra by the Indian Navy. Number 4. Yono-class submarine from North Korea the Yono-class submarine, also as Yugo-class, is a class of North Korean miniature submarine, produced for domestic use as well as for export. 
These submarines displace 130 tons, significantly less than North Korea's larger 1,800-ton Romeo-class submarines. In March 2016, a North Korean submarine went missing at sea and is presumed to have sunk, according to reports from the U.S. and South Korea. The vessel had reportedly been operating off the North Korean coast during the week when it disappeared. American spy satellites, aircraft, and ships have been watching as the North Korean Navy searched for the missing sub. The incident caused eight crew to be lost. Nevertheless, North Koreans have not made an attempt to indicate there is something wrong or that they require help or some type of assistance. Number 5. ARA San Juan S-42 from Argentina ARA San Juan was a TR-1700 class diesel electric submarine in service with the submarine force of the Argentine Navy from 1986 to 2017. It was built in West Germany and entered service on November 19, 1985. And it underwent a midlife update from 2008 to 2013. On November 15, 2017, San Juan, with 44 servicemen on board, went missing during a routine patrol in the South Atlantic off the coast of Argentina. Believed to have suffered an electrical malfunction and a multi-nation search operation was mounted. Within hours of San Juan's last transmission, an acoustic anomaly consistent with an implosion was detected in the vicinity of the vessel's last known location. On November 30, the search and rescue operation was abandoned. However, the Argentine Navy reported on November 16, 2018 that the wreck of San Juan had been found at a depth of 907 meters, 460 kilometers southeast of Comodoro Rivadavia. The submarine's imploded wreckage was strewn over an area of 8,000 square meters. Number 6. Lasharik AS-31 from Russia Project AS-31 is a Russian deep-diving nuclear-powered submarine. On July 1, 2019, a fire broke out on the vessel while it was taking underwater measurements of the sea floor in Russian territorial waters. Lasharik suffered a catastrophic fire, killing 14 crewmen with four survivors. The submarine itself seemed to have not been far from its base and was towed back. The fire occurred at fairly shallow depths at 300 meters, originating in the battery compartment of the submarine. The cause was a short circuit in the electrical system. Supposedly, Lasharik was conducting bathymetric surveys in the Barents. Most of the crew died from inhalation of noxious smoke attempting to save the submarine. On July 5th, four members were posthumously awarded Hero of Russia, while ten members were posthumously awarded Order of Courage. And at number 7 is KRI Nangala 402, the submarine disaster that happened recently in Indonesia. On Wednesday, April 21st, shocking news came from the island of Bali in the form of news that Nangala 402 had lost contact during a joint training mission for the firing of Indonesian Navy torpedoes and missiles. Three days later, on April 24, debris from the submarine was found on the surface, and the Indonesian Navy declared Nangala sunk. The next day, scans positively identified the remains of Nangala and the loss of all 53 crew members on board was confirmed. On April 25th, Chief of Naval Staff Yudo Morgano explained that Nangala 402 was detected by KRI Rigel, which was carrying out a multi-beam echo sounder and was first detected at a depth of 800 meters. The search was also assisted by MV Swift Rescue from Singapore. That's the list of submarine accidents within 21 years. We hope Nangala 402 will be the last tragedy of sub accidents around the globe. Thanks for watching, and as always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more awesome videos.